You guys, look at what you have put me into. You can see. You can see. Last week, Jumoket came here, threw away my bottle. And I don't blame me. I can't. If I blame myself, am I a human being? I'm not. So, I'm going to blame you. Because you people are the eyes of the show. You are the viewers. You cannot send me a message, Dear Larry, kindly change your bottle. Another guest had to come. What you said, family. Look at. You can see where I am now. I have to be pouring bottle or pouring water from bottle inside cup. No more sucking. <laughs> Welcome to what you said. This week on the show, we are starting off with the iPhone 11, iPhone 11 Pro, and the iPhone 11 Max. On the 10th of September 2019, Apple dropped these three amazing phones. And uh, from the 20th, you could order and you could, you could, you know, start using the iPhone 11. Now, people took to Twitter to express yourself, really. People were advising people. Some people were, you know, let's just go into it <laughs> because... I didn't know what this person is really trying to do. So this person, Lola Simon, uh, tweeted, she said, my boyfriend is the best. Thank you so much, my love. iPhone 11, yes. She now posted this iPhone. Somebody now said that. <laughs> <laughs> Aboli Matella. No, no, before, before I tell you what Aboli Matella said, what is, what is wrong with this iPhone? Oh yeah, look at it, wait. What is, what is wrong? What is wrong with this particular iPhone? <laughs> Told me, told me. As Bonnie Matela said, your boyfriend the Apple now. <laughs> she replied, she said it was cheaper without the Apple. <laughs> you guys are the best. You guys are the best. As Bonnie Matela now replied, I said, okay, <laughs> with this Trevor Noah meme. <laughs> As Anna Victor put up this, um, you know, as his own homemade iPhone. Ladies and gentlemen, he shopped the Apple at the half. And they, I mean, if you can't go out there to get one for yourself, please <laughs> make do with what you have. Apple is just 15 hours or something out there. <laughs> now, so at I am underscore Kide says, I thought we said we are broke. And country was really hard. See the way Nigerians are unboxing iPhone 11. <laughs> like it is calculated before. <laughs> That is it. In this life, that's why I don't follow people on Twitter. People are saying, hey, I'm broke. Hey, Buari government, they hook me. Speaking of Buari, <laughs> Buari is on the show today. Buari government, they shook me. Oh my goodness. Some people are buying iPhone 11. Not just 11, 11 Pro. Not just 11 Pro, 11 Pro Max. <laughs> you are chosen. I'm I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> you, you remember that picture, that first picture I showed you of, you know, um, this person's boyfriend, what's her name? At um, Lola Simon. This is where the, this picture came from. Back up which she posted, it came, this iPhone. <laughs> and Dory now replied that, when does the Apple arrive? <laughs> what's it wrong with you? When does the Apple arrive? When does it after God, after God, fear trips. <laughs> after, they now, somebody now, Use Photoshop to Photoshop an Apple deck way, you know, in case, in case to deck way, you know, the Apple did not come early. You can just be using this one, you know. Then somebody, somebody used this same picture. I mean, this is a very huge meme. And then somebody replied, the last one, 100% says, um, I bought the iPhone 11, but I got hungry. <laughs> I ate the Apple. <laughs> Please don't ask me, don't mention me. <laughs> the guy for that same picture. Biggie underscore C6 posted, posted this picture, ladies and gentlemen, you can see it. Posted this picture and then, and I said going to get, I mean, since we can't pay for it, how about we take it? <laughs> with the gun, with the gun and with the mask. Ladies and gentlemen, he said, another person put here, Pablo1759 posted, then my cross just called me sweetheart. Please, how much is iPhone 11? Bro, relax, relax. Okay, um, you know, people are saying that the iPhone, you know, we shouldn't do like crazy things, especially ladies, you know, you shouldn't, even men, you shouldn't sleep with anybody for the iPhone. Tonto DK has an advice for you people. 
Watch it. Actually, I've been speaking about the club. And don't, don't hustle. Don't sleep with 100 men to get this phone. I swear to God, I just bought my own money. It's nothing special. Girls, don't free yourself. It's just a phone. That's it for the iPhone. I think I totally agree with Toto DK, ladies and gentlemen. Don't do anything crazy for this iPhone. But some people are not agreeing as uh, the head of the squad, mm -hmm, as we may know it, Adoni Achebe comes out to say, there's absolutely nothing wrong in having sex with someone in order to be able to afford the iPhone 11. You simply render the service and got paid for it. That's honest work. It's better than stealing. Hmm, Angu. I'm really, I'm a zero now, do. Angu. Angu, come here. Come. Come. Let me tell you something. Come. Shut up your mouth. Nonsense. Don't sleep with anybody for the iPhone 11. It is not worth it. Every time you use that for maybe I just scrolling through Instagram, just one funny video. <laughs> you can laugh. You just, your laughter will die because you, your memory will remind you back if you laugh. If you laugh, look at me, you, you use yourself to get this phone. Ladies and gentlemen, don't do anything crazy for the iPhone. It's just a phone. I mean, look at me. Very, I might change, I might not change. And even when I'm changing, I'm not going to start going guys crazy. <laughs> because you know I'm not changing anytime soon. <laughs> Our dear president, Mohamed Bari, is in the news, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, well, since he came back to office, he hasn't really, you know, showed up in the news. Although his travel blogging has reduced, he was a tourist in the first part of his, you know, uh, tenor. But now he's back again and um, he's in New York this time around. And ladies and gentlemen, this is not funny, but it's funny because really, what is the, watch the video first, watch the video, just look at what happened. He went for the, watch the video. What's the video? President Buhari, Nigeria has a very young population. Perhaps you might highlight what a pathway for a resilient future looks like. Your Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, I share the sentiment expressed by the Secretary General that the world is on the verge of climate catastrophe. Undeniably, climate change is a human-induced phenomenon. It is now imperative that we must step up our collective climate actions in line with the request of the Secretary General, which is in this regard that I wish to reiterate Nigeria's commitment to its obligation under the Paris Agreement, the aspirations enshrined in our national... That was clearly our president in another country, the United States of America, New York, at the United Nations General Assembly. And ladies and gentlemen, let's ask certain questions. Now, the youth, the youth, the youth, and climate change. What is the relation? Maybe, maybe, maybe the, ha, ah, I get it, I get it. Maybe the, the, the atmospheric condition of the mind, you know, atmosphere do affect your thinking. So the, the, the atmosphere and your thoughts. Sir, there's no sense to be brought out of this. There's, there's absolutely no connection, sir. And um, it was posted by your media aides, <laughs> Honorable Mr. Your Excellency, to look good and the likes. Uh, and immediately they saw it, like they didn't even vet the video, they did not look at it, they did not look at it twice. Maybe just say, ah, our president is in New York, where? Send it out, send the tweet, send the tweet. <laughs> they put it out, ladies and gentlemen. When they realized that, ha, huh, the president is in climate change, oh, and they're asking him about the future of Nigeria. They deleted this. Ladies and gentlemen, this is what you had to say about the president's broha <laughs> discombobulation. <laughs> the president, the president misfire <laughs> in New York. Ulaya for Oburu says, I am not understanding Biko. I be this Victor was this video was doctored. Mm -hmm. Doctor Olu Yemi Patrick may reply and say, No, it was not. <laughs> Manifestation TA to the man. I'm not going to read. Why, sir, come. What's this? He said, no, it was engineered. Another person said, no, it was panel beating. Another person said, no, it was audited. Another person said, it was lawyered. Another person said, no, it was architecture. What is wrong with you people? Another person said, it was finance. <laughs> it was finance. It was financed by who? <laughs> Wait, guys, let's talk about this one. Who do you think finance? <laughs> let's say it was finance. Who do you think? Who? Article. <laughs> I 
Atiku, Atiku financed this. He said, no, it was accounted. He said, no, it was facilitated. What is wrong with you people? How you guys turn jokes, and serious issues to jokes is what kills me. Ladies and gentlemen, and now I see why Nigerians always miss the point because this is our president being asked something and then he is missing the whole point. This is the point. He's deviating from the point. God bless Nigeria. Well, I want like to be the one that put him there and whatever we... I don't know what to say. Before I miss fire, <laughs> let's drink water. Cheers. <laughs> this is the video of the week, guys. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Alright guys, thanks so much for watching what you said this week. Um, next week, um, I don't know maybe we'll be having another guest, but get, let's keep our fingers crossed because I'm thinking about it. Somebody will be inviting somebody, they will not be coming on your show. I'm saying they want to take over your show. I don't understand how those things work. So whoever we're inviting next, I have to warn them. They have to sign contract. They will not send anything over the show. Do you okay? Never again. You two, you know. You two, you know. You can't come back here. You can't. You can't. You cannot. <laughs> Please subscribe and click on the notification button to get videos as soon as we post them. My name is Larry Shonubi. Have a great week, ladies and gentlemen. Please order for a new bottle for me. I need to drink water from my bottle. And I can't be drinking water. Isn't it enough? What do you put in? It's enough now. I can't be drinking water. Juice, nice juice from the New York. I think we can sponsor it. I don't want iPhone 11. Peace out. <laughs>